How's it going, everybody? This is the Erroneous One, and we're going to come to you with uh, part three of the Coliseum Challenge. So, here we are. So, this is the, um, the last 15 rounds, I think it is. The end of this one should be a level 300 cloud, which will be exciting. We'll see how we get past that one. Um, but for now, let's jump into this. Uh, yeah, I'm using that one, and I'll be borrowing. Yeah, I'll borrow his, I'll borrow Talon's Rock Titan. Let's see what we got. Hmm. All right, so. All right, so Sora's doing less damage, unfortunately. Now, kind of makes sense in regards to that one, but. Well, there's something for a bit more than that. Um, yeah, we'll pop out BC Mickey. Not much at all there, unfortunately. All right, how's her gonna do? So we've reached that point where I might need to actually change out Keyblades. Oh wow, 4,000 only out of that. That's pretty crazy. And that guy does insane amount of damage. Okay. Um. There we go. Hmm. Alright, so that's a new setup there for those guys. That's quite curious. So I might end up changing out to my other single target attackers. For those ones at least. Let's see. There we go. Oh, 240 cannon gun. That's awesome. So defeat the target enemy within two turns. Alright. Another single target. Um. I guess I got some chance. I am gonna load up right here again. There we go. Alright, let's see if I can do against this one. So what power metal? I'll take all Fuku's, why not? Alright, 240 cannon gun. Defense times 2 on all attributes. So let's go ahead and negate that with our Pooblet. Alright. Sora, what's she gonna do? Hmm. Alright, not too bad. I mean, hopefully more, but not too bad in regards to that sh shot right there. Um, Alright, I did have APP go off again, which is good. I will tap there and hope that Sora does not proc, but he can finish him off for me. So that's something at least. Alright. Through a lot of gauge here, so I can't keep on doing the 30 jewel thing because that's a waste of jewels. So I might end up having to pause the video every now and then and go and refill. But we shall see. This is a new one. Stinging me, 245. Defeat target me in two turns. Use five or more special attacks. Oh. I 
it is quite interesting. So I have 4860 jewels, so I can do this right here. I should just do it twice more in regards to this one. Um, I won't go below 4800. Um, I guess I'll take Eladan's Sid there. Not sure how much it'll do against that guy, but we can find out. And it's only a one cost, so that's not too bad. Alright, so we have the strength up and a defense up. Okay. That was better. Mm-hmm. Tap. There we go. Nice. Okay, so Rock Titan did really well there. That's good. Oh, but I didn't use the five or more attacks. <laughs> Oops. All right, what is that one for anyway? Ah, that's just for, yeah, that's another degree. So I'll come back for that later on when this is done. Armed Warrior. I need to inflict over and whatever. Okay, that's not going to be a problem. Mm. Alright, hopefully this will do it. And for magic, ooh, Snapple has, that's actually a pretty, pretty damn good Mickey right there. Alright, um, I guess of all Yuri's, yeah, let's see what this goes, alright, see how this one goes through. So new Heartless are pretty cool. All right, so this one also, wow, this one has a times three defense over all attributes. <laughs> so I'm going to be walking in there with a, just like a one Magneteer boost up, unfortunately. Alright, let's see what you can do. You didn't proc, which is already bad. Okay. Oh, 10,000 damage. Did you guys see that? Um. I need a different setup for this guy. I don't want to deal with that times three defense on him. That's a little crazy. So. A new setup is required, which will probably be my Olympia, which will probably be this setup right here. With the main damage dealer being BC Mickey. Alright, so there is that. I might take Silver's Shadow. That's not bad, it's neutral damage. I could take Reix's Jack, attack boost 2, fully, yeah, I'll take you, having two, having two uh, damage dealers that are neutral damage to that, it should be better off. Level 250, we have six health bars, so let's go ahead and get rid of those health bars, you don't need them, and give myself some boost. So Mickey's gonna be dealing about 50k a hit. That's no, not, it's not terrible. And 
Jack will be dealing. Nope, without proc, he'll be dealing only 12 damage, so. Oh man, he just gets that times three attack up. Oh, well, you know what? It is what it is, and I shall go ahead and revive myself. I will lose out on the complete on the continue, but that, I believe, is okay in this case. Alright, that should hopefully not come out. Yeah, there we go, okay. Huh. <sighs> Interesting. So I'll have to come back and reassess that one um quite a bit. I don't know what reward was for that one. That was for jewels. Oh man. Okay, so I kind of do want that one actually. Hmm. Interesting that. What was that? No, that's not gonna work either. Yeah, I might have to reassess that setup real quick. I think I can work with that one, but I just definitely need things with um with defense boost on them for sure. So Pugu can go there. Oh, I remember this is my setup that I was using for the high score challenge, which is fine. I can. Potential with that one again? What are you? Yeah, you're busy. So I'll come here and I'll replace you. So put you there, you there. What are you? You're the top price plus one, which is good. Um... There's Bell. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Bell could be there. Hopefully, Bell will paralyze him this time because no paralyze went off, unfortunately. Actually, that's my exact same setup for the most part. I can't really change anything out from that one. Hmm. Yeah, exact same setup. Oh, you know what? We'll try it one more time with this setup. If I can't get this one, I'll come back and do it later on for now. I think that if Bell will paralyze, though, and actually keep him paralyzed, it should be okay. Hopefully. Or I can switch out my um, APP... Racks for my um, my APP racks for my um, uh, poison racks. That might help out as well. Ah, uh, because that one, there's that one. Racks Bay. <laughs> What's on this one? 130. Attack was 2 max. Hmm. Decent power metal to go through there for me. Right, there's power, right? Yeah, no magic. Need a decent magic metal going through for me. Or 
Or maybe I could try out my... Did I switch one out? I did switch one out. Man. Well, that one better. I had a setup that I had there for um, the dark side that did pretty well, but that probably wouldn't work very well in this case. Yeah, okay, so I need that set then. Okay. Sorry about the indecisiveness, guys. Just looking at the things. And uh, how much do you cost? You are two cost. There is a defense boost two on this one, and it does heal. So why not? I will give Manda's uh, Prince Beast, Charming Beast, the Beauty of the Beast one. All right, you gonna paralyze this time? All right, you are paralyzed. That is a start. AP went off. That's also good. Tap here and pray he doesn't go off. He does. And no defense boost too. Ah, man, come on. It's just gonna be a look of RNG on this one. So I'll skip that one and come back to it. Um, I, I do want to keep on with this one. Four and more to continue. This is gonna be turns. Okay. Um, boom, boom, boom. That one I'm not worried about losing this one, so I'll go ahead and pull this one back out. I'm curious. Let's see what the neutral, what the neutral damage one does there, real quick. This one only has five health bars. This is much more manageable. All right, no AVP, unfortunately, which is not a good start for that one. Conserve some gauge, just hit there. And what do you do? Oof, not much at all. Okay, so not to use him this time. I tap. Tap and hag. Oh my god, he lived. <laughs> oh, I knew I should have had him go off. Um, no, we can we can beat this one without that. That was just poor management on my part. Alright, so that one's not going to work out. So if we're going to do that, then we might as well take one that's going to hit harder. So we'll take Reix's. Jack Spur or Jack Sunson again. Two fifty five, okay. No AVP unfortunately again. Better off that time. Okay. Ooh, deepest boost times two this time. Hmm. No APP. All right. 
Got that time. There we go. Alright, better. Better, better, better. But I didn't do the two turns, did I? I don't think I did two turns at the time. No, I did not. Okay. Alright, who did I miss out here? I missed... Ooh, I missed out on a chip, it looks like. Okay. So yeah, these little things, I am going to come back later on and finish, finish out those little objectives that I'm missing on this one. Uh, five or more special attacks. I got that one. Alright, I am going to refill my gauge last time. After this, I'll start going through and doing it um, manually that way. That is still my best option. Two sixty. All right, at least APP went off that time, which is good. See how much Aqua will do. Fair chunk. And Hag, he does pop this time. Kills me in one turn. Okay. That was a little better off. Hmm. Alright, 265. Here, 15. The Wavern. I'll go in there and 10 and see what I can do. If I can't finish, finish them off, then I will just uh, come back and. Or pause the video, go get some more SP, and then trap myself again. Pause there. So I won't, I'll spare you guys the thing of me going through and trying to get more um, SP gauge. Alright. Cool. That went off. That was good. Do. All right. It's amazing how much better you do when your abilities will proc. There we go. All right. Basic one there. Not too bad. Turns forward. Okay. So we'll try my Lady Luck setup. If I, this one can't handle it, then actually, hang on. No, hold on. Wrong one? No, it's just, that's actually fine. Uh, I will take that with me as well, too. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Don't mind these ones. These ones are very, um, not very gauge intensive for me, so I have a better chance. Wow, nothing proc this time at all so far. Except for Sephiroth. Okay, that's something I guess. And this one should finish him off. I would imagine. 
I need the last hit, last hit or two, finish him off for me. Good. All right. Right now, my Lady Luck setup is probably my most powerful in terms of damage dealt and um, cost to deal the damage. Because it has those two or three zero cost ones. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, same as my Wi-Fi wants to work. There we go. So we are on... What are you on? We're on 10 to 15 now. Okay. This one is also a jewel one, so we definitely want to hit it hard. Uh, yes. And down the bottom. Yes. Let's go. Alright, AP did go off, which is nice. Went off here again, which is also nice. Riku procs, which is nice. Will this one proc? It does proc as well. Alright, and now my tab metal. Or my allies tab metal. Okay. Oh, we gained back quite a bit of health, too. How interesting. Alright, tap there. Yeah, finish him off. Cool. Not bad for that one. So we still beat it within a two-turn time limit. Well, not time limit, but, um, turn requirement. All right. Ooh, blue copters. Okay. All right, let's see what happens. Two eighty there, hmm. Yeah. I don't think I'm able to take it out otherwise, so shame I had to use to continue for that one, but it is what it is.
of course wonder though if I can't take out that particular set if I utilize my cage 2 Riku instead of instead of my um, tab metal there something to consider at least So I lost on the Moogle. So the Moogle's not too bad of a loss there in that one in regards to that. Alright. Yeah, I'll check it out. Why not? Let's try Eladan's right there. Hopefully, I get AVP. Nope. AVP? Nope. Not good so far. Not good at all. Hmm. Now tap there, as I need to be able to heal after this one, I'm sure. Yep. So hopefully I get AP off this one. I do not. That's not good at all. No AP procs at all on that one for me. Alright. Mmm, paralyzed too. <laughs> one damage worthless okay so I'm gonna die here but um I'm not going to do that because I can beat this guy out so long as my APP procs so we'll give that shot um, one more go real quick yeah some of this option there so instead of having I'll put that one there just so I can tackle it. Even just tapping will do better than the one damage I got earlier. Alright. That was better off. At least I got procs this time. Okay, I probably shouldn't do this with my rock time, but I'm curious to see how much damage you can do against a 285 opponent when I have max AP like that. So let's find out. That's actually pretty good. So he does about almost he does almost 65k against a level 285 opponent. So that was pretty good. I'll take that in a heartbeat. Alright, so now I have no more um, SP gauge in that one. <sighs> so, who is next on that regards then? Um, 290 invisible. Five or more special attacks. So two turns. Let's just switch that real quick. Since I have two of those like that, I don't need two setups like that for my Olympia. I just need one. So, in regards to that, I can do this. And I'll put that one there. Okay, we'll see how this one does. We'll see how that one does. <clears throat> So, I think I'll do what I did last time and take Talon's Rock Titan in there as a tapper. 
<clears throat> or I can take Robert Zolden in there as well. Hmm. Why not? I'll take that one in there with me. See what, see what that does for me. Alright, six bars. Well, six and a fourth bar. Does proc. Okay, so dealing 4,000 damage. Pop there. Not too bad. Okay, and Mickey will deal almost 40,000 damage. Not too bad. Oof, oof. Okay, I don't know how much you're gonna do. Let's find out. Do this damage. Okay, that's not that's not terrible for that one. So that's not too bad. I'll take that. Oh, except for that, I didn't realize you were gonna be that bad about it. Okay, cancel that. We fine. All right, I'm gonna pause the video real quick myself so I can go and get uh, ASP gauge back for my treasure trove set, and I'll be back in just one second for this. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. Here we go. So, just going to take this guy on real quick with this setup right here, and will we? Do we still have that guy Zolin down there? Maybe? No, it went away unfortunately. Most distressing. Um, yeah, then we'll take Talon's Rock Titan there with us in. Alright, here we go. Okay, so Kuglet. Rock Titan does what? Wow, that was almost nothing to knock him out. Almost. Oh man. So hopefully he won't go crazy. No, he does. 7,000 damage. That does it to me. Debating if I want to do that. change out our setup just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Um Let's, I mean, I don't know. I can do this one. Um, all right, as I put them in Syx there, I'm going to throw in Zaldan there in that spot. Hopefully, it'll help out. And if not, I can throw in my Rock Titan there. Okay, my Rock Titan was dealing about 60k in damage. Actually, I'll throw the Rock Titan there anyway, because that was dealing about 60k in damage, so that was a bit more overall. Alright, so let's see what this one does real quick. Okay. And take... Talon's Rock Titan as well. Yeah, okay. Okay. 
Alright, Nikki, what are you gonna do for me? 31. Alright. My Rock Titan does a full. <laughs> All right, Rock Titan, you're going to be my savior, I think, in this one. 84,000, 84K on a level 290 opponent, 295 opponent. So that was with the three, yeah, three general buff through Puglet and Rax, and then the two power buff increase through Sora. Oh. Uh, Okay. Oop, I am out of... Of course, I'm out of AP. Um... Just for you guys, I'm gonna do this. Just for you guys. Otherwise, I definitely would not have wasted the money on... Or the money on that one. Alright, so that guy is gonna have that buff I think I'm not sure if I can beat my way through it but I will try yeah. all right let's see if I can beat my way through the uh, defense buffs on this guy He still has seven bars left, and I think I only took down like three. Hmm, so I might use a bell setup. Paralysis missed. Not good. Hmm. Twelve thousand. No process again. Did get a APP off, that's good. Speed type. Hmm. I am going to try a trick real quick that might work out, maybe, to help me out with this one. Uh, 
Yeah, I'll do this one. Okay, so I'll swap everything out. So you're gonna go down here, actually. Mm. And I have no idea if this is really gonna work or not, so we're gonna find out in a second. Guess I rely on my rock titan going off like a train wreck. So you're gonna go there. Are you guys ready for this? Because this is kind of crazy, I know. Where did I put him? Where did he go? There he is. Ansem will go... Ooh, actually, yeah, Ansem will go here. And my Rax Metal... No, that's the one with Poison Plus, the other one. Where's the other one at? Up here somewhere that is, so that one's going here. So this is woefully inefficient, but for the most part, um... But that one, I set up similar to that, minus the bell, got me, got me to get that dark side, um, that was in the Mog, um, at a Manti Challenge, is down to the, I killed him in four turns, almost three, but killed him in four turns. So let's see if this one will work for this. Okay, we're taking Talons again. All right, come on, second chance. Work, 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 work. Yeah, all right, here we go. Second chance, he's in effect. All right, he is paralyzed. That's great. Um, tap there. Pretty three, it's time. Only 9,000. Alright. Alright. That worked really well for me. Alright. So I killed him off in three turns. Not too bad. Um... I probably should have put a Zald in there instead of the Rock Titan. I forget that the Rock Titan's damage is based off of how much HP you have. So I might end up doing that in a bit. So there's the cloud, okay. Mmm. Okay, yeah, I am going to change it real fast, because I'm going to try going in there with that same setup. Um... Oh, wait, hey, did I request an accident? I did. I need equipment. Alright, because I need to swap out Titan for Zaldan. Okay. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Uh, I've gotten more, um, more utility out of Ansem than I thought I was going to initially. He's not, he, I mean, he's harsh to use because of that huge, um, HP drop he gives you, but he, I mean, the ability to knock out, um, yeah, definitely doing that, unfortunately. The ability to knock out, um, two tiers of defense and then buff yourself by three at least is not to be underestimated. Um, actually, I think about it too... 
I don't think he's gonna have anything on him. I just realized that. I don't think he has any buffs on him, really, so... This first run through, I need to change out Bell. So we're gonna do him here, him here, him here. And then Illustrated Sora there. To buff up Zelda more. Oops. Okay, there we go. Okay. And we'll probably take Talon's um, Rock Titan now, because right now I think that's the kind of thing that's the best option I have. Except for. Well, you know what? Screw it. We'll take Wolfuku's Tab Metal. I think that'd do a little more than 9,000 damage that the Titan was doing. Alright. So he has seven health bars and no buffs on him right now, so that's something. So Alright. Oh, he didn't proc, unfortunately. I needed him to proc something fierce. Okay, am I gonna live? Am I gonna live? No, I am most definitely not gonna live. Forty thousand. Okay. That's fine. I think I can get through it with this setup. I mean, I might need to change out Ansem, maybe. Because that health drop is a bit much, but um, the tab metal was definitely a good idea. It definitely helped me out there. I wish there was something better I could use, though. Right, the Rock Titan's not bad, but I think he's just going to take out too much damage overall. So I need, I need that second chance to go through really badly. Please proc. You do proc. 20k hit almost. That was definitely really good. Will Tab finish him off? I think Tab will finish this off. And it does. Alright, we just killed a level 300 cloud in one turn with just my Zaldan proccing. So problem, Zaldan was dealing about 20k a hit almost. So was it 19,300? 19, 19, so almost 20k a hit. So that was really good. There we go. Hundred jewels. There's a speed gem. That was not bad. Um, and that's the last one. So that's the final one. Okay, guys. So this is the event. Um, I just went through all of them in three different parts. There. Um, like I said, I'll go back and do these other ones just to fill them up because having those empty slots there just bugs me. So I'll deal with them in a bit. So they aren't too bad. Um. Yeah. We fine. Of them but that's the event um i wish you guys much luck going through this one that's what i did to get through it um if you have any questions or anything please uh comment down below i'll try and help you guys out as best i can um if all else fails and you guys aren't able to knock them out or anything or you don't have like a second chance then hopefully you guys will have like a sleep like an ally will have sleep on one of their medals and you can put him to sleep that last turn um either way thanks for watching guys and i wish you the best of luck in this challenge you guys take care